One of the projects that Jimi Hendrix worked on at Electric Lady Studios during the summer of 1970 was an album titled Ghetto Fighters, recorded by his longtime friends and vocal backup group Tarka and Tunde Ra Alim. Hendrix took time to add lead solos and rhythm guitars on several of their tracks, which had been recorded in the late 1960s at Fame Recording Studios in Muscle Shoals, Alabama. The album was planned to be a street opera, along the lines of a rock opera, but with more contemporary themes intended for the black audience. These productions would consist of musical vignettes describing various life spectrums in the urban inner cities. Even though the Arlene brothers continued to work on the project for some time after Hendrix's death, it was eventually abandoned in 1972. The Arlene stored the master tapes for the Ghetto Fighters in a vault and only began negotiations for its release with the Hendrix estate in 1995. The Arlene's returned to the vault once and for all to finally complete what they and their mentor Jimi Hendrix started in the 60s. The results led to the creation of a unique form of entertainment, the Arlene's dub Urban Street Tales. Urban Street Tales are audio musical vignettes, episodes of raw street adventures that replicate the beat of the urban pulse and blends old school soap opera radio with street reality, innovation, music, and imagination. When you hear it, it's like seeing it, and you can't wait to see it. Urban Street